Lady, two minutes. Uh, thanks, Kian Corla. Uh, Minister, I had the privilege um, in December, along with Deputy Wallace, to appear as a witness for Margaret of Darcy in her uh, defence of her case, along with uh, Niall Farrell. And I think the case that she conducted as a citizen, a citizen committed to defending Irish neutrality, uh, is something which is supported by the overwhelming majority of citizens in this state. And for that service that this woman has selflessly given, at almost 80 years of age, she finds herself incarcerated in Limerick Prison. And I have to say, Minister, I'd like to hear your opinion that this is an absolute national embarrassment. We've letters in the Guardian News newspaper today calling on the British government to intervene and have some rationality in this scenario. And I actually salute the gesture of Mrs Higgins, the President's wife, in going to visit her uh, former colleague. That will, uh, I think, gesture should be reciprocated indeed uh, by yourself and you might make a trip along yourself. Earlier, or towards the end of last year, the United Nations Committee Against Torture asked this government what it was doing about our use of Shannon. People like Margareta Darcy have led uh, that fight. Every month we come in here and we ask you about the countless, and your colleague uh, Deputy Gilmore, the countless numbers of US aircraft who go through Shannon, which are supposed to be unarmed, not involved with explosives, ammunition, not engaged in intelligence gathering and so on. But even when they display cannon on their outward uh, aircraft, still they're not inspected and still they're granted permission. How can you, as minister in this state, allow a committed peace activist to lie in jail while not a single Garda is sent to investigate one US military aircraft in this state? It is a national scandal. You, minister, as far as I'm concerned, should be ashamed of yourself if you had an ounce of Margareta Darcy's commitment and humanity, you would be directing your state forces to deal with those responsible for violence and murder, not persecuting uh, a, a diligent and loyal citizen.